such a nice time in the old mouse yesterday. Uh, we're at Lanzan today, which is beautiful. Parked here looking at the sea. Check out the view. So it's pretty incredible. I'm just trying to get the dog ready. And then we're gonna go for a beautiful walk along the coast to a really nice bay over there, but still feeling really cool and breezy at the moment. And we've beat the crowds. So yeah, feeling pretty good about life. Come along and check out with us. Well, we've only walked a couple hundred meters. The bag is already severely weighing me down. Oh, it's like I need more stuff every time. I've gone mad and bought a tripod to try and aid my filming endeavors. But it's just more shit to put in the bag, right? Oh, and what I really love is to walk unencumbered with absolutely nothing. Oh well. Miss Nancy, you want a treat? Come back, love. Come back, love. Good girl. There we go. Good dog. I am trying to be more careful since some people commented before that dogs do fall off the cliff paths and to make sure she's on a lead if it's dangerous. So that is what I'm trying to do. Um, you know, a lot of it is safe, so she is off the lead, but if uh, we end up going close to the edge, I will put her back on the lead. So thank you for caring about Miss Nancy. It makes me think of the Narnia films, like all these amazing rocks everywhere. Voyage of the Dawn Treader, Prince Caspian. Yeah, you feel me? He pumped. Oh, careful. Careful, B. Hard to be careful when you're just suddenly Goes nuts, huh? Like these do. Woo! Here we go. Okay. Okay. There we go. Come on. I think that's where we're going over there, but I can't see much sand. Now, it looks pretty close, but who knows how long it's actually going to take for us to get there. That's you. Head high bracken and oh, I hate wading through it, wading through undergrowth, it's just gonna be full of ticks. It really creeps me out badly. Is the end in sight? Mm, not really. Bloody great nettles. Now this looks pretty perilous. So I have put the little doggy back on its string. It'd definitely be a lot less funny if she fell off there than if she'd fallen off that rock yesterday <laughs> into the rock pool. Oh, I know I saved her and I'd do it again, but it was hilarious. Definitely see where we're going now. Um, I'm not sure Pig's going to get down there. I don't think she is. I'd forgotten it was like this. It looks like there's a little ladder. Not good. That does not look very dog friendly. Don't worry, Nance. We'll find a way. have to be able to get down. It looks so nice. Oh. Okay, uh, okay, they're really steep, but they are, they are steps. She's not gonna like it. Really steep steps and then crawling across the rocks. I really wanna go down there. Nancy, go on then. Good girl. She's smashing it. I didn't even have to tempt her. She just started going down the stairs. One of her foot slips through, so I 
went next to her and grabbed her harness so that I, you know, so she wouldn't be able to fall through the holes. She's an absolute champ. Poor girl, it's not easy for her. You can do it, come on, sweetie. Clever girl, yeah, well done. Well done. Such a good girl. Oh, wow, oh, it's all right, you're doing it. You got it. You're a champion. Come on then. You want to have a little, have a little something. Good girl. Woohoo! You did it! Yay! Well done. But it's a summer holiday, so I was pretty scared of what it's going to be like. And um, yeah, we're going to have to see. We came really early because I really don't want to be like driving around these tiny roads in the van with about a thousand other people. So we'll see if it is really as bad as everyone says Cornwall gets in summer. The thousand people that are now here are basically all swimming, and I feel really bad. This woman just asked me, Have you already been swimming? And I was forced to admit that although I dipped my toes in, I haven't actually sampled the brine property since we've been in Cornwall. I'm not doing very well. I was actually planning that each of these videos is going to be about going for a different wild swim. So maybe that'll start in the next video. Eek! Brighton. <laughs> There's at least 12,000 people here now, arriving from all directions, nuts. All I can hear now coming from the beach is like a cacophony of barking. And uh, I think it was about time to leave, but that was so nice. Getting up early obviously pays off. The colour of the sea is incredible. We've got to go in, Piglet. I've got to start going in. Okay, that was the last time I don't swim. From now on, I will be swimming every time there is the opportunity to do so. You heard it here first, and I would not tell a lie. Okay, it's totally a seal. It looks peculiar, but... Poor little Nancy. She's so hot. I'm trying to find just a rock for some shade. But uh, shade is... Hard to come by up here. Good girl. This is literally all the shade I can find. This under the rock. It's pathetic. Poor Nancy, you want to sit down for a bit? Settle. She's like, I don't fit there. Yep, good, good, yes. Oh, she's half in the shade. She's got a sunny bun, but she's half in the shade, poor thing. super nice on the beach and of course if you want to go swimming you've got to be near the water but just sitting on the top of the cliffs where you could 
always find a place where there's nobody else is um, almost more relaxing to me than just, yeah, watching the sea from afar. It's beautiful. Beautiful, peaceful, tranquil, confusing. I feel like I'm on holiday all the time, which I most emphatically am not, unfortunately. I had a little doggy. His name was Nancy Drew. And everywhere I went, that doggy did a poo. There she is. Little sweetie. I was too hungry to film the food prep, but it looks pretty good. Chickpea, lettuce, tahini, lemon juice, olive oil. I wasn't actually going to come into the Land's End attraction, but Nancy just desperate to, so here we go. Mommy. It's hard to want to leave the sea behind, always. But, um, but we're going to do it. We're going to get in the van and off we go. So thank you for joining us. It's been totally awesome here and we will catch you on the flip side. Bye.